So I'm here with the famous Jonathan Anton, and he's about to give me three of his all-time top tips. Listen carefully. Well, uh, first of all, uh, let's talk about, you know, women generally like to get ready really quick, okay? So for a really quick style, blow drying your hair straight, get in the shower, shampoo and condition, get out of the shower, take a couple pumps of mousse, run it through your ends, air dry your hair. That's the most, a, a lot of women use a round brush and blow dry their hair from wet to dry straight, and then they use a curling iron. This is a quicker way to get ready, air dry your hair first, section it off at the top, take the round brush, blow out your ends, then blow out the top, and with a flat iron, just smooth out the ends. And then take some shine drops and run it through your ends. For curly hair, uh, because women generally fight frizz, right? The number Every two... Every day of my life I fight frizz. Exactly. Number two problems in America, frizz and lack of volume. So to fight the frizz and beat the frizz, you want to take a shower, shampoo, condition your hair, leave a drop of the conditioner in. You don't necessarily need leave-in conditioner, just any conditioner will do. Get out of the shower with a wide tooth comb, comb through your hair, use a finishing paste or cream, like for example my dirt or my silky dirt, scrunch it in your ends, leave your hair damp, don't touch it until it dries. Keep all the wind blowing it away. Leave it alone. I like it. It's easy. For a quick updo, very simple, grab your hair, oh, no. pull it back into a ponytail, tight rubber band, Tease the end, wrap the end around the rubber band and the ponytail, and spray all that in. A few bobby pins on the flyaway hairs, and then some shine spray through the, through the base of the scalp, and you're all done. Quick three great hairstyles. Daytime, evening, party time. Wow, how do you like that? Three great tips. Go ahead. <laughs> From the pro himself. And anybody can do them. I love it. Thank you, Jonathan. You're welcome. Now, Lucy, I learned about because I saw Reese Witherspoon wearing them, and I'm like, who's she wearing? Because those are really cute. So tell me about them, what Reese buys. Um, Reese really loves the speedy knee pant. It's a very popular pant because you can wear it for a spin class. You can wear it for running. It kind of uh, covers the whole, the full gamut. Um, I'm actually wearing a, a new pant called the Power Cardio Capri. It's extremely popular. And one thing that's really great about them is they come in extra, extra small. So they're very tiny, petite women like Reese Witherspoon can find what they're looking for in our store. She also likes the just the basic training tanks, which we have right over there. Oh, great. Yeah. Now, what I love about your Capris is they come in three sizes. So if you're short, you got, they got your length covered. If you're tall, medium, nobody does that. How did you guys come up with that? Absolutely. I mean, not everyone is the same height. So obviously, you need to accommodate the petite women who are 5'3 or shorter and the women who are 5'9 or taller. I mean, where else are they going to go? So it's really fantastic that we carry those three lengths, the, the regular length, the petite and also for tall women um, and then we also carry quite a few capri lengths as well um, varying everywhere from mid calf all the way to short little like for Bikram yoga <laughs> well excuse me <laughs> for those hussies at the gym and I know you know who you are <laughs> yeah, absolutely <laughs> gotta feel good look good when you're working out it helps the workout great thank you so much Costanza I'm here with my favorite find of the day, Svezda. She has the most amazing clothing. I mean, I'd heard of a lot of other designers here today, but she was someone who I hadn't heard of, and the reason I hadn't heard of it is because her store just opened in Santa Monica. Tell me about it. We made a beautiful store, Svezda, and um, the way I do it, I travel around the world. The way I work from um, with artists and designers from Brazil to Central America to India, Italy, Bulgaria. So from each country, I bring back really unique pieces, from fine to decorative art to home collections. But my true pa passion is fashion. So uh, I, I love shopping. You know, I love, 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 love shopping. So she gets to pay. To sh she gets paid to shop basically because she brings all of her collections that she finds from all over the world to her store. And the one thing I notice about everything, it's all natural. You know, you don't see a lot of handmade pieces, a lot of art and clothing anymore. Everything's manufactured. And this looks really unique, natural, and you know the world's going that direction. I think we're tired of seeing things that are corporately made all the time, right? You know, it, I work with uh, amazing designers where 
Everything is about the handwork, hand stitching, pleating, embroidery. So what you see, wow. it's just a fraction of my collection, just arrived straight from the runway in Delhi, and I'm so proud of it, and it's so beautiful, for it makes uh, even a beautiful woman more beautiful. So, wow, objective. You heard it straight from her, and she's a w wonderfully beautiful woman. So I, oh, I think that her collection would look good on, on just about anybody. So I'm here at Castle Ivar for the Mother's Day retreat, and who do I see but one of the all-time favorite people ever of anybody who's ever been to the castle. Everybody in America and the world really falls in love with this woman, Maureen McCormick, a.k.a. Marsha Brady. Marsh Hi. <laughs> How are you? And she's here with her daughter. I am, Natalie, my, the love of my life. Who's gorgeous, and it's Mother's Day, so I thought it would be really nice to ask her daughter oh. how she feels about having her mother out on a beautiful day at a Mother's Day retreat. It's really, really nice. We don't get to do it enough, so it's great to come out here and to support. It's just great. And what's it like bringing your daughter out with you? Because I, I think America really relates to you as the favorite daughter. And you've got a daughter yourself. Do, are people... I have a favorite daughter, that's for sure. Yes, I do. Are people shocked? That I have a 20-year-old? Yes. They, they are. They're always <laughs> shocked. Yeah. But um, it's, it's the greatest thing I've ever done. She's the greatest thing that I have, her and my husband. I just feel so incredibly lucky to spend the day with her today and to have her with me. And it's just the best. Tell me about your jewelry. Well, it's all handmade individually here in L.A made out of semi-precious stones and 14 karat gold filled metal so it's good quality um, it's all named after women who've inspired us so each piece is given a female name oh, give me an example. like my best friend Shauna these are named after her my grandmother uh, Mary this rosary necklace is named after her no, I have to say, I've seen a lot of jewelry lines, and you have a really nice aesthetic. How did you, how did, what's your inspiration for the colors? The inspiration is basically just that we love colors, and we want to just take inspiration from everyday beauty. Like, there's one bracelet that I was inspired by Las Vegas and the city lights of Las Vegas. And then uh, I was out in my rose garden one day, and I was like, okay, I want to make some earrings that are this color. So... Just from, I would say, everyday beauty around us. Trying to find bliss in your day-to-day -day life. Trying to find <laughs> bliss in your day-to-day -day life. It sounds wonderful. And the jewelry's gorgeous. I'm here with Dr. Larry Cousins, and he is the chiropractor of the stars. From what I hear, he does magical things on the back. So tell me all about it. Well, I've only been doing it now 36 years, and I use uh, basically a couple of techniques that I put together myself. And I get instant results on uh, a lot of pains. I use a lot of nutrition for internal problems. And I just get results. That's, that's the bottom line. I get them fast and people are very happy. And what would you say the, the best thing to do to prevent having to go through all of these procedures? You know, I mean, how can people protect themselves on a daily basis? Just by bending right and absolutely get, knowing how to get in and out of a car. Yeah, I mean, usually I get in and I drag my leg in after myself, but uh, what's, the per what's the correct way to do it? Well, you should sit down with your legs outside the car, use the steering wheel to pull yourself in, and then in reverse, swing your legs out, stand up and walk away, rather than bending at the waist and, and squeezing your body into trouble. So basically what he's saying is if you want to stay out of his office, get into the car correctly. You hear that, Britney Spears? So you put the panties on and then you learn how to get in and out of the car. And he can teach you how to do that. <laughs>